Guess where we're going? Oh, I'm not blind to people. We're going to Italy's Bay! Finally, we left so late, but we going. Hey, Y'all look, we were driving, right? Look at these. We're going through my hometown. They are, they are literally, there was a line of these. We thought the lane was closed. They're literally driving like that with their arrows on. Jerks. Wee. Did we just turn around to go to Kit Kat? Yes, yes, we did. Yes, we did, y'all. <laughs> if you're ever in the South, y'all, there are people good in that line. Cookout. cookout is open. We legit almost died getting here. But it's worth it because it's Cookout. It's cookout. <laughs> and my phone blurry. But okay, y'all. We, we made it here to Cookout. I got the cheer wine. Now, the cheer wine from the fountain is it's the best. It's different than the bottle, but it's all good. Y'all need to come check it Delicious. out. Delicious. Y'all like no nothing in the bag. Nick, it's the delicious. I don't even remember what the hell that was. Oh, I got chicken nuggets. I need mushrooms. I got a quesadilla and a burger. And Kami got. We're looking at your page. She's going to town. The, the corn dog. The burger. You show them the okra. The okra. The fried okra. The fried okra. Look at it's that delicious. beautifulness. I'm going to steal it. We have made it here. You know, eight hours past schedule, but we're here. Beautiful courtyard, Marriott. The obligatory Walmart day. Cheesecake. This is a lot of food. I got the summer roll. I need three. Ketchup too. You just said mustard. They were almost out of the ketchup. It was a mess. This is the thing of beauty. I got the lactate. Here we go. What did you get? Okay. Mango macaron, chocolate hazelnut, and raspberry. Ooh, enjoy. And the special cone. Oh, okay. Y'all, it's a wacky baby inflatable arm flailing two man. I come here every time we come here. So it's just go, I got boxes off. Yeah. Oh well. That looks so good. He is so good. We had to come back.
lady here in Kaminoka. We at the sheets. We didn't film it, but we got this donut. It was awesome. Yes. It was so good. good. Yeah. They had one that was like a Reese's donut. Like, kind of like the Krispy Kreme Reese's donut. So it was like the chocolate peanut butter on top and then the peanut butter flavored cream inside. So good. Yeah. We're feeling mm -hmm. okay because we're about to go home. But we're leaving. Um, <laughs> quick con wrap up. Yes. Some things we didn't care for. Um, the hotel. It was it was okay. <laughs> um, it was, it was one of the okay. con hotels, but there was no microwave. And we yeah. couldn't find the mirror, the full length mirror. Apparently it was inside the closet door. So you had to open the closet door, yeah. blocking the way to the bathroom to use the full length mirror. The whole bathroom area it was, was just, just odd. oddly laid out. Yeah. <laughs> and if you closed the shower door a certain way, you couldn't open the bathroom door. It was weird. <laughs> but yeah. Um,. It, but it was quiet. It was quiet. Um, con wise, they did um, have a strict policy regarding the pandemic, um, which was awesome. Um, mm -hmm. I'm glad they checked, you know, all that, and they made wearing masks mandatory just to keep people safe, especially those with, you know, um, compromised immune systems and whatnot. Um, yeah, Kami. So, I liked the variety of programming that they had. They had a bunch of stuff from Japanese guests that they had to have pre-recorded, um, or it was like live, like a, a live, high, stream. live stream kind of thing. Um, because I guess a lot of them couldn't travel, thanks COVID. Um, yeah. Anyway. Uh, or cold or whatever that term is anyway <laughs> but Her the only thing the was i i i wanted to go to the one of the things that az is great at is actual content that's related to japanese culture so i did i went to tea ceremony i went to taiko drums the taiko drums i participated in that kami did not film because she was busy doing other things i was at the time. i was making candy i was oh. hyper focusing on making candy anyway um that's another grab but we'll get to that later but it not was it was candy, really but fun yeah. but i wish they had put it in a different room because the acoustics were terrible in there mm -hmm. Um, so it was really echoey and it was really hard to hear what the uh, announcers yeah. were saying. Um, but it was nice that it was uh, plenty of space. Yeah. And then the, I attended two things in the room. It was like room 303 that both were standing room only, people standing outside looking through a window. Yeah, the room was Hopefully too small. Hopefully next for... year they will assign those a bigger room. Yes. It was the room was too small for what was going on. Yeah. Like there were people outside still waiting for people to come out just so they can go in. Yeah. I don't I just sat outside. I don't know <laughs> if they just didn't have enough space for all their all of their content and that's why those rooms got they got stuck in those rooms, but these were like things that were a big regular things that they always have every year mm -hmm. so i thought they would have a better idea of like how many people are going to come yeah so it was the amv contest and the um tea ceremony were like in this yeah, tiny really space tiny so yeah. hopefully they'll be able to work that out better for Another year. Grab, we were mad about they canceled the rave and we really weren't keeping up to date on yeah, things yeah we didn't find that out we had two outfits ready to go for we friday had night saturday two night rave outfits and no formal dance outfits and that was the i had only... one formal dance outfit you outfit. did yeah. i didn't have anything to wear to the formal dance we were about to do a concert so. flip on the spot we, you know, we should and then do I decided that. that was too much work. We should do that just for shiggles <laughs> next <point>. time. Next <laughs> time, but um, on the plus side, the cosplayers are awesome. We had some yes. really nice people. They're, okay, so last night, um, the concession stands yeah. had really good food too. Oh, that's another thing. One of them was a little overpriced, but they had a bulgogi I just place. Just expect those. But the ice cream was awesome. The ice cream place mm -hmm. and then the Brewsters. So good. And they had the Korean hot dogs. Yes. 
the Korean corn dogs, they're see, so see good. The video, yeah, I put all the food before the feedback question of this, but yes. We was eating, we had biscuits. Mm -hmm. Kami Noko ate my breakfast sandwich. I'm never gonna live that down. Never. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> she she had bacon, I didn't. <laughs> I had just egg and cheese, and I opened it up and forgot that I had ordered the one without the bacon and just started chowing down. She wanted that Bojangles <laughs> breakfast, and I was not going to mm. stop her, but I was a little was upset. Delicious. So we had Bojangles one day, and we had uh, Biscuitville, Biscuitville another morning. day. They were both yeah. delicious. Yeah, we're on the way back home. And then um, we had some sushi from Shaba Shabu, which Shabu was... Shabu. It's Shaba Shabu. That's how it's spelled. Oh! Yeah. Anyway, uh, I could be wrong. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, y'all let me know. Anyway, it was okay. They were about to close, though, so that might have been part of it. Yeah, it was buy one, get one free rolls. That was pretty cool. Yeah. I think that's all I have to say. Yeah, pretty much it. Um, oh, there's a cool bar called Ruby's mm -hmm. Deluxe. They also had drag brunch there. Out, me and my friends found it by mistake. We were hanging out post con. Um, we and we were literally walking back to the car. And we saw like the wacky waving inflatable arm flake tube man. And we're like, what is that? And then we found out it was like this bar. And we're like, let's go check it out. And it was three dollars to go in the drinks were awesome the music was awesome i requested like three songs and the dj she was killing it she played them right away but mm -hmm. it's awesome but definitely it's just a chilled environment calm people were there regular people were there it was really cool so yeah it sounded like a lot of fun but i was asleep <laughs> she went back so it was great but yeah we had a good it was decent it was di okay so it was different for me because this is like an anime con that i've gone to for years Mm -hmm. Um, well, me too, but this, it had been a long time. Since but the I last did. time I was pre-pandemic, so it was a lot different. Mm -hmm. This time it was interesting. Walking around, it was really hot, so it was like with the mask on, it was hard to breathe sometimes. And then the heat mm -hmm. as oh, we forgot there was a shelter in place because there was a tornado. Yes, I forgot about that. That it was, was crazy. Totally forgot about that. Yeah, we totally got in line for food, and then all of a sudden there was this huge line behind us, and we were like, "What is going on?" And then we looked <laughs> around, and we're like, "The whole dealer's room is full." Oh right. Yeah, we were in the, for context, we were in the dealer's room at the time. There was a flash flood warning and a tornado warning within so, like five minutes. Everybody's phone was going off. We're like, "What the hell is this?" So they told everybody to go to the basement. Yeah, <laughs> that was fun. But, but yeah, yeah, all was well, thankfully. Next time I'll be cosplaying more, and I guess, I don't know if they're going to keep the ball as a normal thing until, you know, the I'm pandemic. guessing they're going to have a formal ball and the late night dance. A lot of other cons do that, too. That's true. Katsu so. did, uh, I know, yeah, they'll figure it out. Anyways, we're going back home, but we just wanted to give a wrap up. Good things for watching. Have a good night. Or whatever time of day it is for you. Bye. <laughs> Bye.